Hello, I'm Mike Russell from musicradiocreative.com. In this video, I'll show you some of the best sound effects for Adobe Premiere Pro. Check out my Premiere Pro audio presets. If you're working with dialogue, different microphones, or you need to do some noise reduction in your videos, you need these audio presets. Head over to mrc.fm slash presets to download them now. That's mrc.fm slash presets. Check the mic and make sure it sound right, boy. It sound right, boy. Okay, here I am. I've got a little sequence that I'm editing together here. Let's have a listen to uh, my sequence so far. This is an example of a cool transition in Adobe Premiere Pro. Okay, so as you can see, like I've done some basic transition there visually, but I want to use some sound effects to really seal that transition and make it sound and look cool at the same time. So I'm using some of our own production library sound effects. You can access them at mrc.fm forward slash sfx. And they really are the best sound effects for doing transitions and any kind of editing or audio design to go with your videos. So check them out at mrc.fm forward slash sfx. In this case, I'm using our production library volume nine. And you see there's loads of breakers here that I can just drag and drop onto my timeline. And here I can sort of line it up nicely with that transition and see how that might work. I might want to just move that volume down a smidge so it's not so loud. In Adobe Premiere Pro. And that actually works quite well. Let's play that from the start. This is an example of a cool transition in Adobe Premiere Pro. So really easy to do using our sound effects library. I might actually want to just split that down the middle and bring another sound effect in that I can use separately so we can transition between two sound effects here. Let's try that out for size. This is an example of a cool transition in Adobe Premiere Pro. And of course, the second part is a bit louder, so let's make that quieter and play back again. Cool transition in Adobe Premiere Pro. And you've got something really cool there. If I want to smooth that over further, I might look for the effects menu here, and I might go for constant power. And that'll do a nice crossfade between both sound effects here to make it really smooth. Let's try again. This is an example of a cool transition in Adobe Premiere Pro. And I think that works really well indeed. So remember, I've got breakers, got impacts, you can get music beds and so much more in our sound effects libraries. They're great for using. What I tend to do when I'm working in a project such as this is I'll drag and drop all the folders from my sound effects library into the project here so that I can easily access stuff as soon as I need it. And I can pop this in at the start. Maybe that needs to go down on a separate audio track. Uh, let's actually view how that might look. Uh, so there we go. We've got another sound effect. I might just tighten that up and bring that in from the start. Again, we can be using the pen tool here uh, to just fade this down when the dialogue starts like so. Let's try this. This is an example of a cool and I could do it like a much easier fade there. So something like that. This is an example of a cool transition in Adobe Premiere Pro. But everything is easily accessible to me and ready to use. And I find importing the folders is really handy because we can have them all categorized here. So a really easy way to work with sound effects in Adobe Premiere Pro. Spruce up your videos. Go and grab a library right now at mrc.fm forward slash sfx. Make sure you like this video and also if you want to see more videos like this, subscribe to my channel and ding the bell so you never miss another audio video from me. Thumbs up. Subscribe for more. Music Radio Creative.